Hello and welcome to Todd's Aquatics. Today I have just fed my quarries in one of my quarry tanks and as you can see I have a male long fin calico sitting on a bunch of eggs. Um, I don't know if we're actually going to be able to see the eggs. Let me grab my little flashlight here. Might be able to. It's going to be pretty tough with this camera. Let me zoom in on this thing, see if maybe we can get a little closer there. Probably not going to give us much of a view, but she is sitting on a bunch of eggs. Yeah, you just have to take my word for it, but there's a big bunch of eggs in there. I think she bred with this uh, female regular Pleco that I have. Um, I've got several plecos in this tank. I just moved them um, from the old 75 I had, so I'm not sure um, who she actually bred with, but I'm guessing it was that female that's sitting right there. Um, I've got another, I think, male that is on the side there. Um, it might be a female. I'm not 100% sure, but it looks like a male to me. Um, but anyways, I have several in there. So it'll be interesting to see when these eggs hatch if it was... The common pleco that it bred with, we'll see what type of ratio we get when they get a little bit older as to whether we got several calicos, whether we got long fins, short fins, combinations of both. Um, just don't know at this point. But anyways, just thought I'd update you with that little bit of good news. And when we've went another probably about five days and I start to get wigglers in there, um, I will be putting these in a breeding box. I've just found over time that it's easier to raise them in a breeding box than it is to raise them in the tank. So um, I will bring you back when I do that in about five days.